Okay, guys, so, before I, so, while this episode's going, I kind of made a mistake. I was testing out a new recording software, and I forgot to turn on the audio, and I did not realize that until when I was editing, which is basically just now. So, mistakes were made, and I really want to apologize for that. Next week, I'll just go back to the one I used, like, two, three year, weeks ago when I originally started Fraps. This time I was just using the testing a new recording software that came built in with Windows 10. It's called Game DVR. So this is a post commentary, I mean post video commentary. I'm probably just gonna uh, speed some parts up and commentate them as they happen. So there's just a little bit of lag there, but other than that, that um, we get into the nether finally. Off camera, so I got some materials that we will need. And yeah, so let me just get it. Let's actually look around this cave. It's kind of awkward commentary after the video is made. There's some uranium. Let's see, we're going to set up our base right now with our crafting station, altar of light, and furnace. So we're just going to put it right here. And god dang it, that smoldering grass is so obnoxious. But other than that, um, let's see, we're gonna make some chests right now. Two large chests should be all we need for now. And then, let's see, um, sticks, right. Because we're gonna tr make some more torches. Just so we could light up the area, e even though that won't work. And right now I'm just derping out trying to make torches. So let's just place some around. Let's set this as our spawn point. And yeah, so there, let's go down this cavern, there, and there, That's, that provides a decent light for our base. Uh, next episode I might want to add more, I don't know, I have no idea. It's good enough to see with, but that's the general idea. So let's see, our first quest, we have to make a pick kappa. So right now I'm just looking at the other quests there are. Uh, Picapa is going to be what we're mainly doing this episode. We're hunting for the iron that we need to make this because we need two iron blocks. The netherrack isn't hard and just in my opinion, I got so confused when I saw the netherrack. I originally thought they totally revamped the whole nether so it's just a huge cave system like Candyland and, um, and Overworld. But then I looked at the stone and right now there's some music, and it was actually netherrack, so I got totally confused, and that smoldering grass is kind of obnoxious too, really, so yeah, let's see now, right now I just grabbed some iron ore I find while exploring this cave, because I actually got really lucky in this cave, later on you'll see I actually found a diamond in this cave, and everything else, so I think right now I'm going to start speeding things up, so yeah. Okay, so we're speeding things up now. I'm basically just trying to find iron to get our Picapa. Or, yeah, we're going to need a Picapa and a Picapa 1, 2, 3. And they both, and the first one we're going to make requires iron. So right now I'm just trying to find the iron, just kind of uh, vein mining. And then I get about the enough iron. I can't find any more. I'm currently making the double compressed cobblestone. And I go to find some sticks. If you guys can tell on the minimap, the bottom left there is a force. So I'm currently trying to head there. Of course, I fail, do fail a little bit. So yeah, I'm just mining. I realize there's lava, so I go the other way. And my, I punch into the lava. It dies, and then when I put it back, it pushes me into the lava. So it's kind of ironic. But other than that, we're currently just mining up. We have reached it. We mine up. So this is when parts get somewhat interesting, so I'm going to slow it down right about now. So it's on normal speed now. I stack up, and when I come out, there's a boss, somewhat, not really, only has 60 health from like a nice mob, just standing there waiting for me. I actually almost die because I do, like, no damage to it. So it's fire was super annoying. It's called the Scarlet Belf. I have no idea, actually, what it drops. I forgot. So right now I kill it. I get the achievement Demon Slayer, so I was somewhat happy. And here is where the trees are at. So right now, I'm just getting the wood we're going to need, dropping a stack of netherrack because we have so much. And yeah, 
Uh, let's see, I'm just destroying another block now. So we have all the wood. Now that I think of it, we really only need one. But I guess I just got extra. So we have obtained all the wood we need now to, in fact, build our Picapa, or the first one. So yeah. Now we just need the iron, which I believe I'm doing right now. But I also found another fortress here, so I decided to mark that just in case in the near future I would. And right now I was just checking to make sure my recording software is still recording. And I was getting some gold for no apparent reason. I actually had no idea, so I just got it for no apparent reason. So as I was saying, right there is the nether fortress. I thought it might come handy later on when we're fighting the wither, I believe, which is the final boss in the nether. So I just marked down my minimap, and I can't spell. So yeah, I mean, other than that, it's basically, I find some iron over there, and the thing is, my pickaxe only has six durability left. So yeah, I'm just going over right now, stacking up with netherrack, which is basically just redstone. I'm really confused why they retextured netherrack, I think. I mean, it looks better in my opinion, but the thing is, it doesn't really look, it makes it not look like the nether anymore. And mistakes happen right here when I accidentally hold shift and I vein miner the entire area and my pickaxe breaks. So yeah, I basically just rage quit right here and then because I went all this way. You'll see that in a second. I eat a steak and I just jump off into the lava. Actually, no, not yet. Yeah, I jump there and I just jump into the lava because yeah. So that happened, and I had to go back, get myself some more enchanted gravitite, which you'll see later. So yeah, it was fun. So right now, I just quit the recording, and I'm back now. So yeah, as I was saying, I went to get some more gravitite. So <clears throat> we mined the iron now, and everything's going good. We are able to finally go back, and yeah, we have all the materials we need for Picapa. And this is actually kind of interesting, now that I think about it. I think I'm doing better than I am. I think this might sound better than my actual narrating during the video. Oh yeah, and also, my spawn point for it somehow was always messed up. So whenever I die, I have to go back to Candyland, and I have to go click the portal and click the nether. It's really a pain. So yeah, uh, right now my Windows thing just beeped. I have no idea why. I really apologize. Because I just upgraded to Windows 10, like yesterday, to try out this new recording software that I'm using right now. So yeah, right now we're making the sticks, because we need regular sticks, so that's why I had to get the trees, because it for the Picapo, you could only use regular sticks. And I'm just throwing some crap into the our chest. We have our double compressed air, Skyru, and now we're just smelting our iron. So we only need... One, two more pieces, which is basically one more nether iron, because for each ore, it gives you two of the ore. So nether ore gives you two ores of that, so for us, instead of having to get an 18 nether or iron ore, we only need nine, since it doubles it. <clears throat> I'm just looking through the achievements now, and there's a blubber, blubber tub for... I have no idea what it does. It's something with smeltery. I'll probably make a smeltery later on in the episodes when we actually need one, but I think for now we're good. Unless you guys want me to make one. So we just get our iron now, and I make another iron block. And now we could finally make ourselves a Picapa. So two iron block like that. It's two sticks in the center, and we have our Picapa. So yeah, we got that now. And then I... This is a troll. I try and just, uh, claim the achievement. But then I, it says I need to make a Picapa 1-2, which requires the same thing, except a triple compress, compressed netherrack. And yeah, so right now, I'm just trying to get the gold, so that's what I'm doing right now. I already had six pieces from earlier, if you remember. So I ran into some lava, I tried to patch it up. I died like six times in this thing because of lava. So right now, you see me trying to patch up the lava and I die again. So off, and I ran out of food, so off camera I'll have to get that too. So yeah, it didn't go so well. I barely survived here, and then I fall again. I'm pretty sure this is the successful one, if I remember correctly. I like barely survived. Yeah, so I get the gold there. Healing stone, I pick half it up. I find a diamond. I was just making sure it didn't fall in lava there. And I find a p final piece of gold I need. 
So right now, uh, let's see, I'm just making sure the crafting recipe is correct, and I'm crafting the triple compressed cobblestone. Kind of a pain without automation, but yeah, I had to just keep on getting stacks and stacks of, uh, whole of netherrack. So now our, I stopped recording, because I have no idea why, and we have our gold now, it finished melting, and yeah. So right now, I'm currently just crafting the gold. I mean the Picapa two part one two three, so we have both uh, Picapas now. We have successfully completed the achievement, and now we have to mine some Nether Diamond, and we already did that. So our next uh, quest is to f craft the Philosopher Stone. So I get the diamonds required because if you guys remember, I had the diamond I got just then, and the diamond I found over there earlier. So right now, I'll show you where that diamond was earlier I found. Let's see, it's right here uh, behind the netherrack when I was exploring the area. I found this piece of diamond right here. So I made note of it because I knew we were going to need it for something. I just forgot what it was. And yeah, so the fleeting thing, whatever, the companion did die. So that's why I don't have the step assist right there. But other than that, we're going to smelt up the diamond ore right now. So we get the diamond, and I try and get the glowstone right now, if I believe. Uh, let's see. No, I was getting the ambrosia. Because we ran out of stuff to smelt things with, and I didn't. Yeah, so I was just getting some ambrosia. And I got this when I went back to the aether to get the gravitite, if you guys can still see in my inventory. Oh, and I already put it away. So right now, I'm just smelting the diamonds. For the philosopher's stone, we're going to need that for later achievements. And I try and get the glowstone right now, but the thing is, it all falls into fire. I only get two pieces. Kind of sad, but oh well. I'll probably get uh, do that next episode. Pretty sure I wrap up the episode soon. Let's see now. I was just getting my shovel because I was going to check outside if there was any glowstone. If there was, I probably wasn't going to end the episode just yet. I was going to finish the philosopher's stone and then ep the episode. But, of course, I didn't find any, so I remember ending the episode off right about now when I go back. No, I fall into lo- How did I do it again? I forgot. Oh, I'll have to see what happens. So, yeah, I couldn't find any more glowstone, so I just decided to wait. So, I take off my stuff, and I jump in lava, I guess. Yeah. Because I have no idea why. So yeah, uh, let's see now, I go back into the nether, kind of self-explanatory or obvious, and I click there, and I end off the episode right now. So I really do apologize guys for the fail audio recording, and what am I still doing, I have no idea. Oh, wait, oh yeah, I was checking over there for glowstone. Why did I end off the episode so quickly? Well, I'll just continue commentating, I guess, as I just try and end off the episode. Don't know why I just continued, and I just realized this pickaxe has like 10,000 durability. Oh, wow, that's a lot. So, sorry for this fail audio, I'll do it next time. But if you guys enjoyed, be sure to slap that like button, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye!